Hi guys, welcome back to another video by your boy George on the channel. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the new PLE cards that have just dropped in WWE Supercard, as well as claiming and combining the new JSO Battle Pass card from the Battle Pass. So that being said, let's get right into the video. Right then guys, welcome back to the video. And as you guys can see, there's a notification on the Battle Pass, but we're not here for that just yet. We're going to go in to pvp as you guys can see i've been sweating out pvp all day we're up to 34,880 points so we've definitely got the battle pass done one thing i also saw just a little low-key thing as i was grinding away for the pvp points for the battle pass i also saw the main man super zomaga barbecue right behind me in fourth place he'll probably overtake me for the week but i mean 30k i mean he's getting there you know he is definitely getting there but again, we're here for the PLE cards. Let's have a look what they look like. I'm here for it. I don't know who we're getting. Ooh, Bianca and Jade. So no male card this time around. The Jade cargo image is not... Ooh. Nah, the cards are nice. Backlash France. You, you got the bit of a... Bit of the portrayal of Lyon France or Lyon, as they say in, uh, in Francais. So yeah, I mean, the cards are nice. I like the way the image of the superstars faded into the background. It's quite a nice card design. Different type of card shape as well. Here's the Bianca one. So you guys are probably asking me now, who am I going to be going for? Bianca or Jade? Jade or Bianca? The answer's pretty simple here. It has to be the main woman. The, the, fear, the fearest one of them all has to be Jade Cargill. And it has to be the pro of Jade flipping Cargill. Oh my god, this card is so nice. Oh man, I can't wait to see the pro animation of this. Hopefully it's decent. I've, I've got enough cards to max her out so obviously i'll get the pro animation for you guys in on this video as well uh next thing we're gonna go through right now is the battle pass so obviously i have completed the battle pass today that was obviously the main objective for the video as you guys can see it's completely done 12,531 points out of 12,500 i cut it fine you know i almost didn't have them ready in time for for the recording today but i made sure i did nonetheless let's go claim all so the first one is the Jey Uso card. So we've got that. That's awesome. We'll lock that. Then we get another 1,000 Super Coins. We'll take that. Then we get two RDPs. Then we'll get a Battle Pass pack with a WrestleMania 40. So I'll definitely take that. I'll take a manager. I don't know if I can... Yeah, it's a pro as well. So I'll definitely take it. As we get another 900 Super Coins there. We then get the Himi Uso No Yeet Attitude with 200 Super Coins. Then we get another two RDPs here. Then we get another 800 Super Coins here. Then we get a gold pack with nothing special in it, so I'll skip it. Then we got a Money in the Bank Battle Time Reducer perk. Then we get another 650 Super Coins there. Then we get an RDP pick there. Then we get the Jeyuso Yeet, Yeet uh, attitude there with an extra 200 Super Coins, which I'll definitely take. Then we get another 500 Super Coins there. A lot of super coins about a I'll definitely take. We've got a team event bout reducer perk there. We get 250 credits there, which I'll definitely take right now. I, I spent a lot of credits on uh, on PvP. It weren't cheap. But yeah, we got a performance center perk there. We've then got the super coin perk there. Oh, super coin perk? We've got super coins there as well as the JZO card back. Then we've got 350 super coins there. Then we get another perk, which is a performance center perk, which I uh, definitely take. Then we've got Fusion Chamber Park. Then we've got a PvP Park. And then we get the portrait image of Jey Uzo, which is awesome. I like that image. And then we get the Pro Jey Uzo. So that was all the um, paid track. So here comes the free track. Again, nothing special in that pack. Then we get another pack here with WrestleMania 40. It's a train up, which I'll definitely take. Helps me level up my cards. Then we get another P uh, RDP pick there. Then we get another pack here. Again, nothing crazy in that one. We get another 500 super coins here. We get another 250 credits there, which I'll definitely take. Get a bronze pack here, Tiffy time. You'll take that. Then you get another 300 super coins there. And then the 25 picks to end it all off. So not too shabby. We're now gonna go into the RDP picks. See if we can get a pool. I doubt, I mean, how many uh, picks we got? We got six. I doubt I'll get a pool. I mean, my board is quite low. I mean, I do want to try, try and get it as low as possible before the new tier comes out. But if we get a pool today, it's not the end of the world. Uh, also, like I said, make sure you guys tune into the Twitch stream next week for the new tier Twitch stream. Twitch.tv slash Sword Giant is the place to be. As always, the link will be in the description down below. As we do get a pool, let's see who it is. It's A-Town Down, Austin Theory. We'll take that. He's obviously in the tag team with... Um, oh, what's his name? 
Forgot his name. Ben, who's the Australian cunt? Ben. Hello. Nonetheless. But yeah, we got um, Austin Theory there. Uh, he's, he's in the tag team with Grayson Waller. A-Town down under. So we'll take that. And uh, yeah, I'll cut back to when we've combined and maxed out the uh, Jey Uso card. So I'll be right back. Right then, guys. Welcome back to the video. As you guys can see, these are my Jey Uso uh, Battle Pass card stats. Completely maxed out to the point where I still need to play for the variant, but I'll get that sorted. But yes, so he's got 2,256 power, 2,241 toughness, 2,525 speed, and 2,668 charisma. I actually didn't play PvP last week, so I've actually not got any momentum slots for you guys. So obviously, you guys, I can't show you guys what the... Um, if you guys give me one second, what the card looks like on Momentum, I've got none. I'll have some for next week, though, because obviously I played BBB this week. But yeah, this is the Jay Uzo card. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of it. Also, let me know what you guys think of the uh, Bianca and Jade Cargill choice for the PLE cards and, and not having a male. Because that's going to be interesting to see who you guys go for there. Also, I have I have had a couple comments uh, underneath uh, last night's video saying that some of you guys don't want to go for this card, mainly because there's a new tier next week. Guys, we have this discussion every time they release a battle pass before a new tier, the card will still be good in the new tier. You guys need to remember that. Just because the new tier is in a week and they released this card, they released this card yesterday, doesn't mean this card is awful. It's still going to be decent when the new tier comes out. It'll be able to compete. It won't be on the upper echelon side of things, but it'll definitely be mid, uh, be able to beat some of the mid to upper mid cards in the new tier. So take that as you will. Obviously, if you guys do want to get a card, go for it. If you guys don't, then don't. But with that being said, that is going to do for the video. So if you guys have liked this video, please like and subscribe already. Like I said, let me know in the comments section down below what you guys think of these cards. But that being said, it has to be the boy George. We're on the road to 3,000 subs, hopefully by the end of the month. And I'll see you guys on my next one very, very soon.